Wall Street is the only place that people ride to in a Rolls Royce to get advice from those who take the subway. What the wise do in the beginning, fools do in the end. The key is having more information than the other guy, then analyzing it right and using it rationally. Never give up searching for the job that you are passionate about. The best thing that happens to us is when a great company gets into temporary trouble, we want to buy them when they're on the operating table. We don't have to be smarter than the rest, we have to be more disciplined than the rest. Most people get interested in stocks when everyone else is. The time to get interested is when no one else is. You can't buy what is popular and do well. Price is what you pay, value is what you get. I never attempt to make money on the stock market. I buy on the assumption that they could close the market the next day and not reopen it for five years. The first rule is not to lose. The second rule is not to forget the first rule. When a management with a reputation for brilliance tackles a business with a reputation for bad economics, it is the reputation of the business that remains intact. The most important thing to do if you find yourself in a hole is to stop digging. It's far better to buy a wonderful company at a fair price than a fair company at a wonderful price. Read 500 pages like this every day. That's how knowledge works. It builds up like compound interest. All of you can do it, but I guarantee not many of you will do it. Risk comes from not knowing what you're doing. Every saint has a past. Every sinner has a future. It takes 20 years to build a reputation and five minutes to ruin it. If you think about that, you'll do things differently. In the business world, the rearview mirror is always clearer than the windshield. Only when the tide goes out do you discover who's been swimming naked. The only way to get love is to be lovable. It's very irritating if you have a lot of money. You'd like to think you could write a check. I'll buy a million dollars worth of love. But it doesn't work that way. The more you give love away, the more you get. Chains of habit are too light to be felt until they are too heavy to be broken. Somebody once said that in looking for people to hire, you look for three qualities, integrity, intelligence, and energy. And if you don't have the first, the other two will kill you. You think about it, it's true. If you hire somebody without integrity, you really want them to be dumb and lazy. Someone is sitting in the shade today because someone planted a tree a long time ago. Should you find yourself in a chronically leaking boat, energy devoted to changing vessels is likely to be more productive than energy devoted to patching leaks. The rich are always going to say that, you know, just give us more money and we'll go out and spend more and then it will all trickle down to the rest of you. But that has not worked the last 10 years and I hope the American public is catching on.
You are neither right nor wrong because the crowd disagrees with you. You are right because your data and reasoning are right. Don't get caught up with what other people are doing. Being a contrarian isn't the key, but being a crowd follower isn't either. You need to detach yourself emotionally. There seems to be some perverse human characteristic that likes to make easy things difficult. You know, people talk about this being an uncertain time. You know, all time is uncertain. I mean, it was uncertain back in, in 2007. We just didn't know it was uncertain. It was uncertain on September 10th, 2001. It was uncertain on October 18th, 1987. You just didn't know it. Honesty is a very expensive gift. Don't expect it from cheap people. If you're in the luckiest 1% of humanity, you owe it to the rest of humanity to think about the other 99%. There comes a time when you ought to start doing what you want. Take a job that you love. You will jump out of bed in the morning. I think you're out of your mind if you keep taking jobs that you don't like because you think it will look good on your resume. Isn't that a little like saving up sex for your old age? Risk comes from not knowing what you're doing. I insist on a lot of time being spent almost every day to just sit and think. That is very uncommon in American business. I read and think. So I do more reading and thinking and make less impulse decisions than most people in business. I do it because I like this kind of life. The most important investment you can make is in yourself. It's better to hang out with people better than you. Pick out associates whose behavior is better than yours and you'll drift in that direction. You only have to do a very few things right in your life, so long as you don't do too many things wrong. What an investor needs is the ability to correctly evaluate selected businesses. Note that word selected. You don't have to be an expert on every company or even many. You only have to be able to evaluate companies within your circle of competence. The size of that circle is not very important. Knowing its boundaries, however, is vital. The difference between successful people and really successful people is that really successful people say no to almost everything. I've seen more people fail because of liquor and leverage, leverage being borrowed money. You really don't need leverage in this world much. If you're smart, you're going to make a lot of money without borrowing. I will tell you how to become rich. Close the doors. Be fearful when others are greedy. Be greedy when others are fearful. Diversification is a protection against ignorance. It makes very little sense for those who know what they're doing. I am a better investor because I am a businessman and a better businessman because I am an investor. If you aren't willing to own a stock for 10 years, don't even think about owning it for 10 minutes. Put together a portfolio of companies whose aggregate earnings march upward over the years, and so also will the portfolio's market value. An investor should act as though he had a lifetime decision card with just 20 punches on it. One can best prepare themselves for the economic future by investing in your own education. 
If you study hard and learn at a young age, you will be in the best circumstances to secure your future. The people who are most successful are those who are doing what they love. Opportunities come in frequently. When it rains gold, put out the bucket, not the thimble. Thought-provoking quotes have the power to inspire us. Which quote from the video resonated with you the most? Let me know in the comments below.